Hey everyone, we're back, and uh, we're back in the arena today. We still have a lot of work to do combat training wise, so that's why we're here. You'll recall last time we got Xandria ranked up to Adept, which was nice. Um, and we also gave Alluring Skull a two handed sword, which was equally nice. Um, so, let us. Actually, at this point, let's go ahead and throw Jacob into another novice duel. And we can start working him up towards um, adept level, hopefully. <laughs> and, and you will hopefully recall that we switched back to whoops, we switched back to the metal bar here for Jacob. <laughs> Not the flashiest, not the most powerful weapon, but for various reasons, it is the appropriate weapon for me right now. The primary reason, of course, is, as I mentioned in the last episode, I can use, basically I can hit someone at any point on this metal bar, and I guess it I mean, I don't know for sure, but I think it does equal damage no matter which part of the bar you hit someone with. Whereas before, like with the bill hook, I basically am hitting, you know, when I hit them with the bladed edge, that's what's doing a lot of damage. But if you hit them with the haft, uh, or the shaft, or whatever you want to call it, it doesn't do all that much. So that's why I like the metal bar. And of course, that's why the bardiche is a little bit better than the bill hook for me. And that's also why the two handed sword is nice, obviously. Okay, let's see what else is going on here. Here's an adept level elimination that is very difficult, so we'll do it. Um, unfortunately, Alluring Skull is still recovering from his last elimination, so we're going to have to go with Xandria. All right. <laughs> Got all mixed up there, <laughs> movement-wise. <laughs> this is not looking good at all. Ah, man, we took a little more damage than obviously than I would have liked. So we're gonna take some of this stuff here. Um, I'm going to switch over to those greaves, that's very nice. Some chain legs is also very nice. That arming cap, uh, let's see what else. This waistcoat, we don't have anything to put on over that, do we? I think we already have a tunic on underneath. Uh, or no, that was the coat. Okay, let's put that back on then. That's what we're looking for to replace the waistcoat, yeah. Okay. Oh shit. So one of the things that I'm really trying to work on, and as some of our viewers have pointed out, uh, is footwork. And, oh damn. And the big thing is, I could, I don't know, I consider myself to be fairly good with the, the, the footwork in terms of my relation between me and, and the combatant, but what's really bad is my spatial awareness, like for the rest of the room. Um, what I mean by that is... Did we already have the chain shirt? Yeah, I guess we did. Uh, what I mean by that is, I'm always paying attention to like where I'm standing relative to my, my enemy, but I'm never paying attention to the walls around me, so I always end up getting backed into a damn wall. And then what happens is, when I get back into the wall, I have to change the camera, I have to do this, I have to do that. And just in general, it limits my options and it's not good. So, and I'm doing it right now. It's just backing up towards the wall, again. So, it, when in, t in terms of footwork and positioning, I need to really work on circling away from the wall. 
Ow. I think that's just slightly better right there, getting out of the way, but... Oh, that shield is so fucking annoying. Man, we barely, just barely survived that. I should probably just take a lesson from that and pick up a sword and shield. Ah, but I'm so bad with... Well, I mean, we can at least set that up secondarily. Where the hell did that damn sword go? Oh, there it is. I'll probably not use that, or I wouldn't even have time to switch to it, but whatever. Okay. Did we have a belt? No, we didn't. Uh, let me just compare these chain leggings real fast. They're the same. That's what I figured. Um, these shoes might actually be better than the ones I have on, possibly. No, they're the same. And, ooh, we don't even have wrist protection. Now we do. All right. That's right, I just did that. Now, oh shit, I made a mistake there. Ah, damn it! As long as you're not holding down the attack button when they hit your shield, it will not do any damage. But if you're holding down the attack button, it will do damage. So obviously the moral of the story is don't be holding down the attack button when you get attacked. Oh shit. I kind of like that heater shield. I'll probably just leave it there, but I don't know. I kind of like it. I'll put it here, even though we wouldn't have time. Oh, yes, that's a good helmet. These greaves are better. Um, that, yeah, that covers it for now. Hey, right, we're doing better in this particular elimination match than I would have thought. All right. Now, just because I'm using the sword and board does not mean that I need to neglect my counterpunch style. Oh shit, as you can see right there, the shield is not a guarantee that I'm going to parry something. Still got to do the old footwork thing. Damn! I got lucky with that one. I just happened to choose the perfect ah, ah the perfect time to strike. At least we got a block with the shield that time. No! Shit! No! God! Damn it! We're so fucking close. Oh man, that pisses me off. All right, whatever. I'm over it. That does, oh man, that does piss me off, though. I'm not over it. <laughs> okay. Um, Alright, not too bad. It's not like we're dead or anything. Let's take a quick look over here. Uh, there's another Bardiche, but I don't think so. What the hell rank is, oh, that's Master Rank, of course. Um, now, how about these, are any of these helmets a decent rank requirement that we could actually buy it? No, of fucking course not. All the sweet armor is beyond our rank. Alright, whatever. Okay, so, let's see what is available this time. Uh, well, damn it. Well, we'll do the, we'll do the Challenger with uh, Jacob. And the only reason I'm doing Challenger instead of Duel is because we get a slightly larger payout. Yeah, we gotta pay more to play, but it's not, it's a single silver coin. More. <laughs> Whatever. Love those rep 
posts right after the parries. Oh shit. My spatial awareness is screwing me over again, or my lack of spatial awareness. Or situational awareness, or whatever you want to call it. Not what the hell that was. Ooh. Alright, come on, we should be done here. There we go. Cool. I do very much love that metal bar, not gonna lie. Okay, so what else is going on around here? I so we could do another duel, I suppose. Now there's an elimination where we go in as an adept and fight expert level people. That seems like a really bad idea, so we're gonna do it. Put a luring skull in. Man, if we were to win, look at that payout. One gold, eight silver. But there's, I mean, there's no way we're going to win, but that, that would be sweet. All right. We do have the two-handed sword, though, so I'm hoping... Hoping that I can do pretty well with that. I really, really hate this map. Going back, oh, going back to what I was saying about the spatial or situational awareness. There's so little room on this map. Okay. Sweet. Uh, this will do for now. This waistcoat. Better greaves. Um, don't really foresee a situation where we would use this particular tiny ass. It's like a dinner plate. What the hell kind of shield is that? Um, and that's nothing special. Um, I want. Nah, I'm gonna leave that bar mace or whatever it is there. Uh-oh. So obviously I'm trying to move away from the walls. Oh shit. And maximize the space I have to work with, if at all possible. Not exactly working out right now, just because we have some weird <laughs> slow dance going on here, the two of us. I keep getting impatient and not waiting for my my counter strike and instead I'm just so now sometimes it works and of course that relates directly to what I'm saying about staying away from the walls and stuff because as a counter puncher you're generally you're not leading the dance so to speak like this they're always you're always retreating um, but hopefully we can kind of adjust. Okay. Um, I think we already have a chain shirt on under here. Yeah, that doesn't matter. Um, that's superior. And the one I just picked up is just regular. So, leave that there. Greaves helmet. No, we're good on this. Uh oh. That's not good. I didn't... Oh, man. Oh, here it goes. It always happens really quickly when I start falling apart. Oh, that was beautiful. No. Oh, what? See, that's what I'm talking about. What a crock of shit, man. Every time I do an elimination, I, I do so well, and then I fuck up at the end. Whatever. We almost died, by the way, but we're still there. I can't... Oh, I can't fucking believe it. What's weird is I've done really well today, but I have fucking nothing to show for it. Trust me, if you don't believe me, go back and look at some of the previous Arena episodes. We're, today we're doing fairly damn well. But we just keep... We cannot get cr across the finish line. Um, hmm, adept level, and it's only going to cost me three gold. Well, otherwise this gold's just going to sit there. So we're going to do that. Um, who needs it? Let's, ah, hell. Let's give it to Zandria for now. It is adept level anyway. And I already have like a coif, which is better than nothing for a luring skull. There we go. 
Okay, so what else is going on here? Let's... I th think... Let's put... Yeah, let's just put Jacob in a duel real quick. Seems like a... Basically our best option. Oh, it's not... Shit. He's not fighting at novice level. So he's still using the bill hook because I didn't go back and change his novice weapon to the metal bar. Alright, that just means we're going to have to deal with this for now. See, now you see what I mean about when you with the bill hook, if you don't hit him with the blade, you're almost just wasting your time attacking. Ah, oh, that'll make a nice, oh yeah, yeah, that'll make a nice gif right there. Alright, fairly satisfying. Okay, so, um, let's do an adept duel with Xandria real quick. So we're back to the Bardiche. Oh my, this is not good, we're but already, yeah, yeah, like I said, I can feel it when it's going to be one of those runs where they just start annihilating me. So I had to kind of back off and reset the rhythm here. Ah, uh, hell yeah. All right. All right, let's do... Let's do one more match for today. How about... There's another elimination. That's just... That's not good. I, honestly, I would, I would jump right into it if I had full health on either of my adept level people, but unfortunately, I don't. So... Instead, let's do. Let's close things out today with a little master level pugilism. Why not? Haven't done any pugilism matches today. Oh, wow. Now, this opponent is rather huge. I kind of don't want to get punched by this person. The amount of force that's going to be behind those punches is going to be ridiculous. But fear not. Ah, oh, yeah. All right, all right. So again, I know if you look at the win-loss column for today, it doesn't really seem like I did too well. But I think I did. So go to hell. <laughs> anyway, thank you as always for watching. Please hit the like button if you enjoy the series, and we'll see you next time for some more Xanima.